Welcome to Fun Drawing with Piyali. Here we show you different type of drawing with fun and easy way. So if you want to learn drawing in a fun and easy way with fun facts, then subscribe to our channel. Now let's start with today's topic. Hi my youngsters. How are you all? I hope you all are very well and I am also well. Anyway, so the weekend has come and the weekend means it's time for fun drawing with Piyali. Today's drawing topic fantasy scenery with bees, flowers and honey drawing. So, are you all ready? I know you all are ready. So, let's get started. Kids, if we think about it, every single piece of media is always about fantasy. But the fantasy genre is a whole other thing. A branch of speculative fiction with magic and dragons and roller coasters. Sure, anyway, we are big fans, fans of fantasy movies and TV shows, particularly when they are done rightly. But here we are today, we have fantasy art, also which lets us open our minds windows. Whatever we want, we can draw. Be there through our imagination. So, let's enrich ourselves with some fun facts while we draw this. Fact number one. Fantasy art is the genre of art that depicts magical or other supernatural themes, ideas, creatures or settings. While there is some overlap with science fiction, horror and other speculative fiction art, there are unique elements not generally found in uh, other forms of speculative fiction art. Depiction of ancient myths, legends as well as depictions of modern day fantasy in the form of divine interventions and other magical supernatural forces are very common elements. And help distinguish fantasy art from other uh, forms. And dragons, wizards, fairies and other fantastical and mythical creatures are very common in this fantasy art. And uh, thinking about this, what might be the first fantasy art? Well, the origins of fantasy art can be found in England in the mid middle of 19th century. Lewis Carroll's children book from 1865, Alice in Wonderland was the first book to have illustrated these pages. Fact number two, honey bees are super important pollinators for um, flowers, fruits and vegetables. These means that they help other plants grow. Bees transfer pollen uh, between the male and the female parts allowing plants to grow seeds and fruit. Honey bees live in hives or colonies. The members of hive are divided into three types, queen, workers and drones. Fact number three. What are these buzzling bugs most famous for? Well, of course, delicious honey. But did you know that they produce honey as food stores for the hive during winter? Lucky for us, these efficient little workers produce 2-3 times more honey than they need. So we get to enjoy the tasty treat too. And if the queen bee dies, workers will create a new queen. By selecting a young larva or like newly hatched baby insect and feeding it in a special food called royal jelly. This enables the larva to develop into a fertile queen. Fact number 4 Honey never spoils. A typical beehive can produce anywhere from 30 to 100 pounds of honey a year. To produce a single pound of honey, a colony bees must collect nectar for, from approximately 2 million flowers and fly over 55,000 uh, miles. 
uh, honey is medicinal too you know there are different flavors and colors of honey and not all bees make honey now the last one fact number 5 there are more flowers than we can count as of right now botanists have discovered more than 270000 different species of flowers of that number a full 35000 are simply of roses and are considered some of the most valuable flowers in the entire world and not to mention this number grows every single day and there are still many different species yet to be discovered and china boasts are the oldest flower in the world Hi cute angels we hope you enjoyed 
today's fantasy scenery with bees, flowers and honey joy and these interesting facts. So till we meet next week with another exciting drawing, watch Fun Join with Piali. Wow, that's fantastic drawing. Thank you my little friends for joining in today and do not forget to subscribe our channel if you like our drawing sessions and you want to learn this fun and easy way of drawing and grow your knowledge with fun facts. We will see you soon with another exciting topic. Till then, stay safe at home. Bye-bye.